Hi. Hi, let's go for a walk. It's really beautiful here. Take a look at what the uh, Beach of Combate has to offer. Obviously, the water is pretty amazing. And off to the right, that's the village, the town of Combate, Pueblo. Uh, we just saw a little fishing action from the Pelicano. We'll walk down this way a bit. There are quite a few uh, seashells along the way here. Not a bad beach for beach combing. Here's one. Pretty. Very smooth sand. And it's not super hot, which is nice. Up to our left is actually the state forest. And there's a trail back there we'll explore later. But for now, let's just go for a little walk. Tuesday looks like here. It's not crowded at all. Weekends can be. Buenas tardes. And there's all kinds of little spots you could choose to sit up, like in here. Now if we walk up to this spot, and across some of these roots here, You'll see that there's actually a trail. Unfortunately, there's some litter as well. But there's two trails here. I don't have shoes on. But in the distance, we'll go down this one trail carefully. <laughs> you can see the little lagoon is back there. And I think I will put on my running shoes and take you for a walk a little later. This is a beautiful tree as well, despite the fact that people left their litter there. It's unfortunate that people often leave their litter in some of the most beautiful places here in Puerto Rico, which is one reason we often carry trash bags with us. And if you look over here, and the trees are just beautiful, you know? And there's so many of them. As you get further down, oh look, and here's a piece of coral that washed up at some point during the high tide. High tide must come up pretty high here. And we get to this end and there's a lot of shells to be gone through and found. Shells and coral. Coral and shells. Right here next to this beautiful part of the long passage. I decided to go for a run. I'm at Combate Beach with Beto and there's a trail nearby or at least I heard there was and I decided to go on it and run. And this is what it looks like. I mean I'm not currently running. This is about a mile and a quarter into my run but it's a really nice trail. Some of it's shady. It's really a bike trail but I was reading the directions instructions for cyclists and told them to move to the left if they ran into walkers and runners so i know it's okay for me to be here but wow huh it's just a lovely trail off that way through the trees is a beach and the um, caribbean sea i guess you would call it there no waves just beautiful and then on this side is some sort of a lagoon a huge birding place, though oddly I've never seen anyone in their kayak in it. I would like to kayak in it. I have to figure out how. Behind you can see mountains, and you can also see that uh, it's threatening a little bit. So I should probably be headed back in case it rains. But it rains every afternoon here during this season, so you sort of get used to it. But all the way down the other end of this lago, this laguna, is Combate Beach Resort which is a maybe black walk to the water on a 
on a dirt trail, a sand trail. So this is this is my one of my go-to runs now here at Combate Beach Resort, which is uh, part of Cabo Rojo, and it's about uh, 15 miles, 28 minutes from our house. And uh, the beach itself is absolutely glorious, and it's next to a little town of Combate. So until next time, los vemos, which means we'll see you. Hasta luego. See you soon. Adios from Cabo Rojo.